of me. You're at my vanity doing your makeup and filming it. Scratch off my address in case it's shown, but yeah, this is my first like paid Instagram collaboration, which is so awesome. I've seen them on TikTok before. It's like this contour thing. I need to like figure out how to unbox this. I cannot. Oh, if you're interested, you want to check it out, you want to purchase it. I think if you use my code, it gives me a little bit of commission, which is pretty cool. If I can open up this dang box, I will show you guys what's inside. They really like taped it down. Oh, okay. So the first thing is this little blender brush. That's so cute. I really like that. I need to get like a uh, makeup brush set. I think I mentioned this in my most recent like uh, Sunday reset video. But all of my makeup brushes aren't even in a set. I need to find like a cute minimalistic set. I kind of like this vibe, like the white and gold. We have the content creation guidelines. Super simple. It's just like neutral background, great lighting. Make sure you use these hashtags, like super simple stuff. I really like the packaging. It's, it's cold actually. But here's what the little contour sticks look like. Let's open up the uh, the copper shade. Yeah, it's a tad dark, so I might have to go light when I'm... Oh! It's not like a, a cap where it's like you have to like snap it shut. It's actually magnetic, which is really cool. Swatch that. That's like pretty for the fall, I think. It's like the highlighter. Ooh, I like that for... um eyeshadow too. I like using highlighters for eyeshadow. I think this is a really cute set. I am about to start filming. This is the tripod I'm going to use. I got this from Amazon. I'll link it down below. It's in my storefront. Absolutely love this tripod because it's so portable. It just literally opens up into a big old tripod like this. How awesome is that? And it comes with a Bluetooth remote. Um, you can use that when like shooting Instagram photos and stuff, but I'm going to set this up on my vanity right here. I'm honestly, I have like a really cool idea. Earlier I said that I could use this highlighting stick as eyeshadow as well, and I thought it'd be really cool to integrate all of these products in different parts of my makeup routine so the contour can be my contour but it could also be like my eyeshadow and then the highlighter can be the highlighter and the eyeshadow as well and then the blush can be the blush and the lipstick so i think that's kind of like the theme i'm going with in this video filming from the camera app because i find that that's like the best quality i'd rather just like film the raw footage on my camera roll and get to editing on my software, which I use Final Cut Pro um, because I just edit everything else on my Final Cut. So might as well just edit my short form videos as well. POV, you're at my vanity doing your makeup and filming it. The lighting actually looks really good right now. So I'm so glad that I decided to film this collab today. roll is done and then I'm gonna go ahead and just do my face makeup and then I'll come back and start filming the contour pretty okay honestly really impressed with the eyeshadow looks really well did I blend this out all the way honestly not very familiar with contour I'm just gonna take my beauty blender and just be safe because that's the last thing I want is like it unblended. The highlight on my eyes first because usually I do like my eyes first and then my face so I'm just trying to figure this out. Literally whenever I film my makeup it takes me like twice as long to do my makeup because I could bust this out in 10 minutes and so far it's been like 25 and we're done now i just have to edit it um i need to take an instagram photo really quick but i'm gonna change my shirt i think what i'm gonna do is just like something super simple with like putting the highlighter on my cheek like that like something cute so we'll figure it out but i will be right back Okay, 
so it's been a little bit since I last vlogged, but as a quick update, I shot the Instagram in feed photo. You guys just saw, I used the app LensBuddy. I love that app when I'm taking Instagram photos by myself, which is like 100% of the time. It's a really great self-timer app. If you are starting out on like Instagram or content creation, I highly recommend getting the LensBuddy app. So yes, I took that photo, exported it, and I edited it on Tezza. I used to use Visco all the time to edit my Instagram photos, and I really like it, but I started using Tezza and I kind of like the filters a little bit more. They have like this film shop collection and they have a disposable filter, which I have been loving so much recently. And then I also use the cake filter and that just kind of helped like brighten the whole like overall photo up a little bit. And I liked the colors that it had on there. And then I just slapped the disposable filter on top and it kind of gave like that vintage like grainy kind of look. So absolutely love it and then I totally forgot I had to shoot a cover photo for my reel so what I did is I just stuck a bunch of like highlighter from the stick on my hand and then I showed the stick a little bit I'll put like a photo up on the screen I think it looks amazing especially with the disposable filter I'm gonna have to figure out what I'm gonna do for the fall time because I feel like that theme is like perfect for the summer I think the fall I'm gonna do like more like neutral colors but somehow integrate some like graininess Anyways, we'll focus on that later, but yeah, so I exported that and I actually scheduled them on the Planoly app. I just recently found out about the mobile app. I used to do some scheduling on the desktop, but now that they have a mobile app, I'm like, the game has changed. So I started my seven day free trial to see if I liked all the features. And since I have like so many posts I need to get up in the next couple weeks, I thought might as well just schedule them all now. So far I'm really liking the Planoly app. I feel like the way that you navigate the app on mobile is a lot better than on desktop. So now everything is scheduled and ready to go out and I believe the posts will be up by the time this video goes up. So if you wanna support the collab, if you wanna check out my Instagram, of course I'll link my Instagram down below. I'd appreciate all the love and support, but yeah. With that, I hope you guys enjoyed this little video, a little behind the scenes of an Instagram collab. If you enjoyed this video, let me know in the comments below. Give this video a thumbs up, subscribe for more UGC content. I also do vlogs, cleaning videos, the whole thing. So subscribe if you want. But with that, I hope you guys have a wonderful day and I'll see you guys in my next video really soon. Bye.